Hello, good evening, teacher. Well, hello, how are you? I'm very well. All right, what great. You, teacher? I'm doing great here. Good evening, guys. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Thelma. Good evening. Welcome. I hope you had a great weekend. Hello, Alvin. Welcome. Good evening, everyone. Hello. I'm driving right up there. Okay, mm -hmm. Blanca. No problem. Thank you for notifying me. Hopefully you get okay. home safely and soon. Thank you. Thank you. I hope so. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. I'm driving too. All right, great. Great. All right, Alvin, I hope you can make it home soon and hopefully you can join us. Thank you, teacher. All right. Let me see. All right. We're about to begin. It's eight o'clock. Hello. Abigail also, thank you for joining. Let me see. Good evening, teacher. Hi, welcome. Let's Let me see. So, how was your weekend? How was your weekend, Thelma? Relaxed, teacher. It was relaxed? Yes, relax. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you, teacher? Oh, here, yeah, I just I had a lot of work to do. <laughs> like a lot it. of work. <laughs> yeah, this weekend. Today and, and tomorrow, like my heaviest days, my heaviest days. Ooh. Tuesdays are like my heaviest. Monday are heavy, but Monday and Tuesday are the heaviest. Tuesday, the top. By Wednesday, I'm a little bit more free. Wednesday, and Thursday. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, well, right. But Wednesday I'll be well, more relaxed. Teacher, I didn't finish the the middle the middle I, I don't I don't remember the middle term. Okay. Well, but I, uh, I I have to till till twelve o'clock, right? Yes, right to okay, twelve o'clock. Okay. Uh and I send the list right to the group. Okay. I send it on Friday, right? I say al grupo mandé listado de quienes who uh, needed to finish it. But remember, if you don't finish by today, administration will contact you, okay? And they do, uh, they write your name. So avoid, avoid that, Blanca, because get up. Get yeah, up. yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to finish today, but, but not now. Because okay, right. yeah, yeah, I understand. <laughs> I'm just letting you know. I'm just letting you know. Yeah, yeah. That way uh, you, they won't call you. All right, they won't call you because they will contact me also. All right, and if they contact me, I'm just going to say, Mira, yo mandé listado al grupo, es lo que yo voy a decir, right? So avoid, avoid having the administration contact you because todo queda registrado. All right, so if they call you, they put down, why did they call you? So just avoid all that, right? Avoid last minute uh, mishaps. So, and Today at 12, I will send. A las 12 mando yo, ya sea la nota que tengan, esa es la que voy a mandar. Right? By 12 o'clock. Eh, there's only two. Nomás hay dos personas que no, no, han, no han cumplido ese requisito. Bueno, ya lo mencionó Blanca ahorita que lo va a hacer. And the other person, hopefully they do it also. Let me see the rest of you. Um, your grades, eh, los demás, ya sus notas ya las envié. Right? Ya están en el sistema. Y como es instant instantáneo. All right. So the rest of you already, already, uh, already, uh, your grades are already in the system, right? Los únicos que no he puesto son los de, las dos, los dos que quedan. Y pues ahí, hay cada quien, right? All right. Let's see. 
what is today's uh, what do you what do you think we're going to do today, Freddy's? Actually, we're gonna start unit three. Mm hmm. All right. What so. about what about you? All right. Anyone else? What do you think we're going to do today? I think we're going to be a review teacher. Exactly Did right. A review. Exactly yes. Of the week. Yes. Right. We're going to do a review because today's the last day of unit two. But we already finished unit two, right? Yeah, we that's did. what I thought we were gonna. <laughs> no, remember it ends today. Every Monday it ends, right? And then next Monday will be unit three, and then um, then unit four. We finished in two weeks, right? And then we're done. We are finished, right? Let me see. Uh, yeah, we're going to do some review. I have some questions for you, okay? And this will be, esto sería um, the last activity for unit two. It will be the last activity. Now, the activities that you did on Friday, the activity that you did on Friday, um, I sent it to you, right? And I checked, I just scanned it. If I wasn't looking for like, I wasn't looking for that because the activity was based on research, on research and investigation, right? So if I saw that you took your time to investigate the positive points of the three PLs that I, uh, that I shared with you in class, then I put very good job or excellent, great job, very good, those types of things. And if I saw that you did or great effort, if you didn't finish, I put great effort or something get, showing me that at least you you try to finish right and that's what mattered in that uh in that grade it wasn't really a grade it was like an effort on your behalf to do this activity in groups all right um let me see it was a group activity as a matter of fact i'm going to share screen mm -hmm. Let me see, hold on. Do, 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 do. Hello, Doris. Hello, Iris. All right, this is class. Hello. All right, welcome, welcome. Let me see. need to do something right here now in today's class like I mentioned earlier or like Alvin mentioned let me share it first share screen do, 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 do. all right Freddy's can you read please yes Thank you. speaking activity worship jobs Breakout Rooms Review, Monday, November 22nd, 2021. Teacher Mr. Henry, Intermediate Four, class number 15. Very good, excellent, good job. All right, so this is class number 15. So as after today, we only have 10 more, 10 more classes. In other words, two weeks. In those semanas, we're finished with this, um, with this module, all right? Now, I have some questions for you that you will do. But first, I'm going to, I'm just going to, I'm going to show you what we plan to do today, okay? I'm just going to give you a preview, a preview, so you can be aware. We're going to do a speaking activity. You're going to do this, four questions in breakout rooms, and then you're going to create your own questions, right? So after you do these, then you create your own questions with your classmates. We're going to do as, remember this, as and as, this activity. I think one person did this when we had the 10 minutes together. This is just a small practice using as and comparative. And I also have this to unscramble, unscramble. For example, what do you think number 20 is? At the fácil. What do you think this is? What type of what type of job would this be? 
anyone can decipher pilot pilot right pilot all right pilot and yeah right pilot right so this will be pilot and then you're going to try to do the rest here and maybe see if you can figure them out do as many as you can and i also have a critical thinking activity right this one this is similar one entregar you will give it to me individually, right? Four questions, all right? Y como pueden ver, le dice highlight in your own words, all right? And I'm going to explain to you what these are, and then you're going to write a paragraph. You're going to write a, a paragraph explaining uh, what you have learned in, the, in Unit 2 as far as logistics, just 50 words, 50 words, all right? Nothing big. So that's what we plan to do today. That is the agenda for today. Let me see. Um, I'm going to do the first attendance. All right. Let me see. Abigail. Present. All right. Thank you. Blanca. Present. All right. Thank you. Brenda, Brenda, okay, not here. Carlos. Good evening, teacher, I'm All here, right. present. All right, thank you. Doris. Present. All right, thank you. Edwin. Present. All right, thank you. Let me see. Francisco. Present, teacher. Thank you. Fredis. Present, teacher. All right. You see Glenda. Present. Okay, thank you. Iris. Present teacher. All right, thank you. Jackie. Present. Okay, thank you. Jarvin. Present. All right, thank you. Jennifer. Jennifer, okay, not here. Juan Jose? Okay, thank you. Carla? Carla, okay, not here. Miguel, Miguel. Okay, no answer. Neftali, Neftali. Present teacher. Thank you. Rolando. Rolando, okay, not here. Thelma. Present teacher. Thank you. Janari. I'm here. All right. And finally, Alvin. Present teacher. All right, thank you. Let me see. All right. Okay, let's continue. All right. First of all, I want to be, since it's Monday, I know you, you, you're coming off a weekend. Anyone did anything interesting this weekend? Anything did any, did anyone do anything extraordinary? Nothing, nothing at all, all right? Alvin, did yeah, you? Alvin. Alvin, did you did you go where you said you were going to go? Let me see. I know he's driving. Yes, teacher, I'm still here. <laughs> no, I said, did you go to the to the volcano? Yeah, I I take a long vacation, so I'm here. All right, all right, great. Maybe. You but can... I'm in class, teacher. Yes, that's uh, that's excellent, right? When you get home, yeah, maybe you can share with us what um, what you did. Maybe tomorrow. All right, tomorrow yeah. you can break it down for us, right? Yeah, right. no problem. All right. Okay, teacher. All right, let me see. All right, let me share screen. Let's go back. All right, so look at this questions here. Let's begin with some speaking. Neftali. Yes, teacher. 
Can you just Thank read you. them for us, please? Okay. Which is more important, the skills you learn in the school or in real life? Explain. Would you consider studying abroad? Where? Why? Talk about it. Which are the best schools and universities in your country? Explain. Does education warranty a good job? Brainstorm and discuss. All right, Create good. your own questions. All right, very good. Can you repeat this word right here, Neftali? Guarantee. Okay, guarantee. 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 Yes, you put the E, right? A double E, all right? So you you do the, the pitch. All right, very good. Does education guarantee a good job? Brainstorm and discuss. And then these are the four questions. These are critical thinking questions. These are not just like yes and no, no. Right? These are, you have to explain, talk about it, explain, brainstorm and discuss, all right? Brainstorm means when you start just thinking about it and you're doing critical thinking analysis to answer your, these questions. So I'm going to share this in the group, All right? And then, let me see. All right, I send it to the group. And what you're going to do is I want you to get ready to answer these with your classmates, all right? And then when we do this activity, we're going to do a review in comparatives using as, 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 all right? And maybe some negatives with it. Now, let me see. Teacher. All right. me, yes, Fredis. That's the question. All right, yeah. If you uh, before before you ask me, Fred, um, I would like to tell everyone that if you have any questions of any of the words that you see there, please ask me. Okay, that way you won't be confused when you're asking the question. Okay, Freddy. No. It's it's a different question. Mm -hmm. Who was the winner? Oh, I haven't decided yet. <laughs> I haven't oh, decided okay. yet. All right, because. Um, if um, if the person does like if the also I'm going to exclude the ones that if they don't do the homework in the platform, they will be eliminated from the prices. Oh. All right. So I was waiting. I'm going to wait till twelve. After twelve, the people that didn't do the homework, I'm automatically going to exclude them from oh. the prices. So I'm waiting for that also. All right. So a lot of good presentation. Yeah, there were, and I'm still working on them. I'm still working on them, right? I still, I'm like, the thing, you know what, what the hardest thing is, Freddy? Oh, what is it? I want to see the, 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 the most difficult. I have selected some already, but I haven't finished doing the overall 100% analysis of everything. Why? Because nobody's presentation was like 100 percent right so it was like okay but everybody tried everybody did their effort at a hundred percent right but for example i'm going to give you an example freddy's now that you mentioned a presentation was good this presentation was good this presentation was good this presentation was good. but then here's the dilemma one presentation probably didn't have a, a the reforms that something that they will reform right and this one did but didn't have numbers you see yeah. so which is which do i value more right the one that didn't have the numbers or the ones that didn't probably do the last part of something that they would uh do a reform for the company right so and then another one did the other two but they didn't have like uh uh for example the the uh the third party logistics or any type of logistical aspect to it, right? 
So it's like, okay, esta tiene todo menos esta. Esta tiene, and then I will have to calculate and I have to go back and try to figure out the importance, the most important aspects of it. So it's, I'm having difficulty with that, right? Because it's like, okay, I'm not choosing just one yet, right? Or two yet, because even those that I have chosen already, like, like pre-categorized, they're missing something, right? And then these are also missing something, but it's not the same. They're not the same. So I'm having that uh, that deal, and I have to wait to 12 to see um, who hasn't turned in their homework on the platform, so I can just exclude them. And that would be easier also, right? If they don't do it, then I would just exclude them, right? And um, the ones that um, didn't have their cameras on, I already excluded them, right, from the prices. Oh. Let me see. Oh, the ones that didn't present it, right? There were like three that didn't do the presentations. So yeah. they are automatically excluded, automatic. So that was, that was you know, that lowered, um, that lowered my, uh, my difficulties with that. Let me see. All right, so that's where I'm at right now. But I guarantee you that by this week, and this is a guarantee, aquí si le doy mi palabra, by this week, you will get the results of who is the winner, precisely, right? Precisely. Who is, number, who is first place and who is second place? Or there could be a tie, and I would just split. <laughs> right? It would be like, okay, I think these are both accurate. I'm just going to give both of you that second prize. All right? That could be also a possibility. All right? That could be also a possibility because I saw a lot of them and I saw them twice and I'm like, what, right? I'm still debating. I'm still debating. But I give you my word that by this week you will have the results. That, and I keep my word, so you will get those results by this week. Okay. All right. Thank you, Freddy, for asking. And thank you for always asking uh, in class, right? Always participating. Uh, I already sent in your report as well, Freddy. So what I'm telling you is awesome. All right. So thank you. And for a lot of you, for the rest of you also, I already sent your individual reports. Remember that I do one at midterm, and then I do one at the end, at the end also, right? At the end. So I appreciate everyone that, that, that participates in class because this is for your own personal growth. All right, class, so I'm going to, if anyone wants to take a screenshot, you can take a screenshot, yeah, but I already sent it to the group, but if you want to take your own, you can, all right? So I'm going to take it off in about three seconds. Three, two, one. All right, I'm going to take it off and I'm going to, I'm going to leave it here for right now. I'm going to put you in breakout rooms. All right, let me see. Um, is there anyone here that cannot do this activity? Please let me know. And I will give you. Good evening, teacher. Yes. Uh, I think that I can do the, this activity because I was in my job and I am a writer home. So I don't understand the activity. Okay, Carla? Carla? Yes. Okay, now I understand that. Entiendo que entró tarde, right? I understand that. But um, if you look, can you look at my screen, Carla? Yes, I can see Okay, it. it's really not an activity where hay unas indicaciones, sino que es una speaking activity. Okay, I can do it. All right, so I didn't want you to be like, oh, no, no sé qué hacer, right? No, Carla, it's just speaking. It's just speaking. And I send it to the group. Lo mandé al grupo ahí. All you have to do is talk about this with your classmates, all right? This would be like something, for example, if you're driving or something that you can't, but uh, can you still do it, Carla? ¿Todavía la puede hacer or, or, or no? Yes, I can do it. Uh, oh. Just I am arriving to my home, so I can do it. Okay, great. Thank you. Thank you for your participation. 
All right. All right. All right. Now, anyone else that maybe you're you can't do it for real? Alguien más? Any questions? Blanca, can you do this activity? Or I know you're driving, right? If you want, I can exclude you, Blanca. Or Alvin. Teacher, me. It's too much noise here right now. Uh, all right. Alvin, right? So let me see. I'm going to take yeah. uh, All right. Thank you. All right. Blanca. Hello, Blanca. Okay. No answer. I will exclude you also. Okay, Blanca. Alvin. Anyone else? Anyone else? No? All right, let's go to breakout rooms. I'm going to put you in in, in pairs. In pairs about I have to do this manually. All right. Okay, room number one, Abigail and Francisco. Room number two will be Doris and Carlos. Room number three will be Glenda and Iris. Room number four will be Jennifer and let me see Carla. Number four, number five will be Jarvin and Juan Jose. And number, number six will be Freddy's and Janari. And room number seven will be Neftali. Jackie, I'm going to put three here. And Edwin, and let me see. Thelma, you're going with Freddy and Janari. All right, everyone. Breakout rooms. Please enter. One, two, three. Hi, teacher. I'm home right now. You can put me on the break room. Ah, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Blanca, for, for answering. I had already left you out. All right, let me see. All right, I'm going to put you with Edis. Let me see. All right. Hello, Jennifer. Hi. Hello. Jennifer. Hello, teacher. Okay, can y'all begin, please? You and Carla. Yes, teacher. All right, thank you. Um, sorry, Carla. Okay, let's start. How was your day today, dear Carla? Mm -hmm. That's not the questions that I. That's but I'm. I'm going here. Because. 
before go to, to the question. Oh, okay. All right. But maybe he doesn't hear. Carla, can you hear? Carla. I'm oh, sorry, I have my microphone off. <laughs> yeah, I was talking and <laughs> I say, do you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> no worry, Carla. <laughs> yes, sorry. And uh, can we, you? Oh, yes, I just asked you first, how was your day today? Um, well, but my day was great because I have free time. My boss didn't go to the job, so it was free time. And how about you? Um, first, thank you for asking. Um, well, and so, but I hope with the base I will be better. Okay, let's go to the question. Which is more important? The skills to learn in a school or in a real life? The uh, maybe maybe when maybe if uh my career is is the my Interesting. Teacher, how do you say career of interest? My, my, my career that I'm interested in. My career that is interesting. Interested. Interested. In. In. Interested. I Which consider one? to study in other country. Which career? I would like to start in maybe medicine. Medicine. Yes. Experience, the experience that you can have in the real life. Um, I think that uh, in your life, Electric hydraulic. This, ah, this ah. Are, 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 yeah, I think that the the career is very funny because you you can you can learn a lot of things because you are uh, watching uh, different kind of things. Yes, interesting. How interesting because but I want to say. In El Salvador, I, I, I studied in the University of El Salvador and I finished my career or my major uh, two or four years ago. 
and I, I, I Hard. Yeah. Because but they know. Yeah. Took me like like around six months in order to start understanding. So we, everything changed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well. Oh. Uh, acrylic nails over <laughs> <her> nails. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, oh my god, how do you spend thirty five dollars in in nails? Why we should do, go to the supermarket and spend the money over there? You know. Nowadays, right. there is a the, that is a, a good business. Um, uh, it is well, a good business. I, mm -hmm, yes, I have a well.
Lukman to take over. Hello. Hello, teacher. Are you Hello, teacher. Yes. Okay. Did you ask your own questions also? Yes. All right. Great. All right. We're going back to the main session. Okay. 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 Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thank you. All right, hello. Hello, teacher. All right, welcome back, everyone. All right, now, remember, after you have finished the questions, you were supposed to create your own questions, right? Do your own, right? I hope, I know some of you, I don't understand sometimes, right? I'd be like, okay, these are the instructions, and for some reason, some of you forget, right? So remember, you were supposed to also when you finish those in la captura que dice abajo in green create your own questions right lo puse en verde así put it in green right create your own questions so when you finish those you were supposed to create your own your own and that was up to you to decide what questions you were going to ask your classmate right because i entered some and they were talking about something totally like, hey, yeah, what did you do? Yeah, yeah, right? And it was like, okay, <laughs> maybe they're finished and it's time to close the breakout rooms, right? But I want to ask a question, honestly. Did you create your own questions? No. <laughs> no, right? No. All right. Neftali, did you create your own questions with your classmate? No, teacher. When we were talking with the first question, we create another, but ah, okay. not well, that's good. at that's the good. end. All right, great. All right. Well, if, if you're creating your own, that's, that's, that's good also, because if you have a question and then you elaborate another one, you're still using your critical thinking skills, right? So that's great. All right. That's awesome. So that can, that can pretty much balance. What about you, Jackie? Did you create your own? No teacher. Uh -huh. All right. Well, I'm be all right. I, 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 I respect that because I entered, I entered breakout rooms and and I I saw it was like some were beginning to like remember that when you start. I'm going to give you an example. Right? Now, I, I've been a student too, right? So I know that when we start communicating, when we do breakout rooms, a veces no es fácil salirse del tema. Right, it's easy, right? Because you get you get caught up in the conversation, and before you know it, ya pasó el tiempo, and it's like, oh, okay, so we didn't do it, right? I understand that, but the, the good thing is, if you're speaking and you're communicating, that is also a plus, right, to enhance your your English skills, right? But there have been times that I have entered, right, and I've, I'm starting to notice that. Estoy notando ya eso también, right? It's like you deviate from the topic. And you start talking about, yeah, I can see this, yeah, I'll do this and I'll do that, right? That's good, that's good, right? Because you're still talking. But remember that complete the task, complete the task, and once you complete it, then you can start, yeah, yeah, what did you do? Yeah, right, what do you do? Yeah, you start talking about that, right? I'm just giving you a little, um, a little recommendation, okay? Just a little recommendation, right? So I wanted to say that, and I respect your honesty. Trust me, right? Mucho puede decir, no, yo sí hice, I did my teacher, right? Mm, right, but thank you, Jackie, for being honest, right? I respect teacher. that. <laughs> sorry, but we discussed three of them. Yes, uh, three of them? Three of yes. them? Oh, so you, three of them. all right, well, that's good. So you needed a little bit more time to finish then, right? Yes? Yeah. All right. Well, great. I wanted. I also wanted to ask you that, right? Teacher. Será mi otra pregunta. Did everyone? Teacher. Did everyone? I'm going to. I'm going to change of device because I'm on the phone and I'm going to change to the computer. Okay. No problem. Thank you, Blanca. 
Oh, please don't take the attendance, please. <laughs> oh, I'm about to do that right now. Oh, oh no, Blanca, you're absent. <laughs> no, I got you. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm about to do the second one. Now, who finished? Can terminó? Who finished all four? My group. You did? All right. Yeah. Okay. The the uh um, two teacher. Excuse me? Jennifer, you finished? We took yes, Carla and Jennifer. Yes. All right. Okay, great. Great. I'm trying to calculate. Right. I'm calculating I'm calculating also how much time I'm giving you to ask for questions, right? I know they're critical thinking questions. No son, no son respuestas de un minuto, right? So I understand that also. So I'm calculating you okay, also in that level to see, okay, should I do four? Should I do six? Or should I do just three, right? Remember, uh, in prior sessions, I had done like, and I second una le di como diez, right? I think it was like ten. It was a lot of questions, and it took like two days, right? I think we continue to the next day. So I'm also here. Aquí estoy también calibra. I'm, I'm, I'm calibrating to see how many of these critical thinking questions should I be putting. Y eso también me ayuda a mí como docente, right? To see if it's if it's four, six, eight, ten, right? So I think three or four will be the average, right? Will be the average. I think that when I do critical thinking questions. So this also helps me, all right? Better. Esto también me ayuda a mí mejorar cuántas preguntas debo hacer when it relates to critical thinking questions, right? So I'm thinking, well, I can put four and then you do your own with 30 minutes. I thought it was enough, but I'm seeing that maybe I need to add a little bit more time or take out one. Right? Instead of having four, maybe two, three. All right, so I was taking the time also so I can better calibrate. Para calibrar estas preguntas. All right. Okay, but um, for the most part, yes, you're doing an excellent job when it comes to speaking, when it comes to speaking. Let me see. Blanca, you're back. Yes, I'm back. All right, because I'm about to, I was going to wait on you to do the attendance, okay? Okay, thank you for waiting. All right, so you're good now. All right, perfect. Let's see. Okay, class, I'm going to do the second attendance now that uh, Blanca's here with us. I did not want to leave her out. So let me do the second one. Abigail? Present, present. Okay, thank you. Blanca? Present. All right. Brenda? Brenda. Okay, not connected. Carlos? Yes, it's you. I'm here. Present. All right, thank you. Doris? Present. All right, great. Edwin? Present. All right, thank you. Francisco. Present, sir. Thank you. I'm here, teacher. All right, Freddy, thank you. Glenda. Present, teacher. Okay. Iris. Present. Okay, thank you. Jackie. I'm here. Okay, thank you. Jarman. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jennifer. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Teacher, I'm here. Okay, thank you, Jennifer. Juan Jose? I'm here, teacher. Okay, thank you. Carla? Present. All right, thank you. Miguel? Miguel? Okay, not here. Neftali? Present, teacher. Okay. I want to ask you a question, Neftali. Yes. Is it Neftali or Neftali? Neftali. Con el hyphen at the end? At the end. Okay. The reason why I ask because I'm pronouncing it because you have it here in the in the in your name on the conference, right? So I'm saying no, no, 
quizás no es Neftali, es Neftali, right? Como no tiene la tilde. So I wanted to ask you that. So it's Neftali. Neftali. All right. That's right. right. All right. All right. Let me turn off my. All right, there it is. All right. Let me see. I'm going to modify it here in the in the platform also porque no tiene la tilde, right? So I keep saying Neftali, right? Neftali is Neftali. All right. Let me change it. Do, 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 do. Uh, let me see. Okay, Roland, Rolando. Not here. Thelma? Present teacher. All right. Janari? I'm here. All right. And finally, Alvin. Present teacher. Okay. All right. Thank you all. Okay. Let's. Let's continue with this. Let me close. <laughs> okay, class. Now, this is just a little review. This is simple, okay? If you understand comparatives, right? And you probably say, oh, yes, right? What is this about, right? This is in relation to, um, either. let me see. This is in relation to um, using the comparatives. Like for example, on page 21, we talk about as, and we also saw it um, in unit one also, right? So if you can see the comparatives, as far as I know, and this is something that it was at the end of unit one also, all right? And I wanted to, to share it with you so we can just do a little practice, okay? Uh, this was at the end of unit one and it's also a, mentioned a little bit in unit two, but this is just a practice, all right? As, as, right? Let's do, I'm gonna, let's do the first one together in class. Once we do the first one, you're going to be like, oh yeah, all right. I think one or two of you that have been with me the extra time, uh, you already did it. I think it was uh, Jennifer, right? Jennifer, you did this with me extra 10 minutes. Can you, can someone do the first one? I'm going to do the first one for you. The blue car is, remember we have the adjective here. Uh -huh. is as, as fast as the real car. Very good. So we have as, as, and we're comparing the blue car to the red car. But what are we comparing? We're comparing the fast. adjective. Yes, la rapidez, right? So mm -hmm. we're using fast as an adjective. Now, what about negative? Peter is, Carlos? Yes, is, is not as 
uh, tall as frail. Okay. All right. Very good. So when we use negatives, when we use negative, we put the negative first and then the as, then the adjective, and then as again, plus the subject. Okay. That's how we use when we do negative. Do not put as at the beginning of not. No, we are not principio de not. It comes after not when we use negatives, okay? So, Peter is not as tall as Fred. And then you're going to do number three, four, five, six, right? Do not send it to me. No me lo manden. Do not send it to me because we're going to do it here in class. All right? And then I'm just going to call on you. No me voy a llamar alguno de ustedes. I'm just going to call on some of you to give me the complete sentence just like um, uh, Carlos just did on number two. All right? So do them here. This is just like a little practice, all right? Using comparative, but using as. Not comparative adjectives, but using as. <clears throat> remember you if you're probably wondering about this like okay teacher and what would how would you say this in spanish right and so you if you're probably wondering like how will you translate this as as right it's como decir eh, el carro azul es tan rápido como tan Como, all right? And that's in singular, right? And if it's plural, it's tan como if it's plural. So Peter no es, no es tan alto como Fred, right? That's what the as as would mean in Spanish. For those of you that are probably wondering, how would you say that? Or how would you translate? That's what it stands for, all right? So when you finish, just let me know when you finish. All right. Teacher, excuse so me, I have a question. Uh -huh. cool. So uh, what is the different uh, that using that or using the other comparatives? For example, uh, the blue car is faster than the red car. Okay, 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 Carlos. Carlos, Carlos. Good question. Ah, yes, 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 because okay. that is the most, the most is. Yes, those are comparative, those are some comparative yeah. adjectives. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, those are comparative adjectives. Here, we are, we, we're not using comparative adjectives, all right? We're using the adjective here, and we're using as, 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 or not as, all right? Okay. But the comparative edges are, they are different. They are different. They are where you use taller than, right? Eso ya tienes otras reglas, right? Yes. Where you have the comparative and superlatives. Yes. Yes, All right. All right. Yeah. Those are totally yeah. different. There's, they're used similarly, but they are different because superlatives are with with the entire quantity and comparatives are just one on one. Right? And these y estas tienen sus propias reglas, right? They have their own rules. But if you want me to send you some um, some work with comparatives, I can do that, Carlos, if you want. Okay. Okay. Um for example, uh what what how we we can we can know uh, for example 
uh, when is correct to use has, 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 has. Okay. With that when, when you're comparing two things that are like, all right? When you're comparing, okay? Es como cuando dicen, eh, eh, tan como in Spanish, right? Tan y como, right? But in English, we don't change the words. We use as, as. And then how do we determine when to use it? When you're comparing, when you're comparing, cuando estamos comparando, comparing similarities. Okay. Similarities. Uh, okay. This All is right. for similarity. For, or, or it could be negative also, right? Un, unlike similarities also, but we only use not, all right? We only use not, but all we're doing is similarities, okay? For example, the blue car, the first one, is as fast as the red one. We're comparing two cars with one adjective. That's it. Comparing similarities, all right? Okay. So and then, he... and, and then unlike similarities, which is negative, all we do is add the negative. But we're still relating. Siempre nos estamos relacionando con tallness, right? Con, con la altura. Yes. All right. We're still comparing both things with the same thing. Peter is, we're comparing Peter to Fred, but we're comparing their height, how tall they are, right? It's like similar, but they're positive. Exactly, the opposite. Correct. Perfect. Remember, if it's a negative, please include it. Please include it. Let me know if anyone is finished. Let me know. Okay. Are you finished, teacher? You're finished? Great. Awesome. I finished, teacher. All right. I'm finished, you. too, teacher. All right. Great. So I'll give the rest about two more minutes. So do I. All right. This is a fairly simple activity. It's just practice. All right. What we're doing is practicing. Okay. Don't complicate yourself. I'm finished. Okay. Thank you. Excellent. All right, about maybe one more minute. And then I'm just going to ask if there are any volunteers so we can do this activity as quick as possible, All right? Because I think it was easy. Neftali, did you think it was easy? Neftali. Sorry, teacher. Did you think this was easy? Uh, yes. <laughs> right? Yes, it was, right? Yes. All right, great.
yeah, I have I have to give you all something easy because the next ones are not gonna be that easy. So I have to give you something easy every now and then. <laughs> all right, let me see. All right, let's. Uh, I don't think I have to write them down. I think if you just listen. you can figure out if you're correct or, or incorrect and then fix it on your notebook if you have it there or wherever you wrote the the answers okay so we know the blue car is as fast as the red car peter is not as tall as fred we did that one right number three who wants to do number three complete sentence please not just the answer complete who wants to do number three? A bio. Okay, go ahead, Jennifer. Oh, who was it? The bi the violin is not as slow as the cello. Cello. Okay. Cello. <laughs> All right. Re re repeat it again, please. <laughs> the the violin is not as low as the cello <laughs> oh very very good right it's not as low right as the cello very good right very good excellent not as low as the cello excellent number four who wants to do number four my teacher okay go ahead Thelma. okay oliver is as optimistic as peter okay that was number five right all right ah excuse me okay number yes, four yes the four is excuse me this copy is as bad as the other one okay very good can you repeat number five for us please i'm going to let you do both okay then <laughs> repeat number okay. five for us. okay oliver is as op optimistic as Peter. Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Thelma. Okay. Two for one, right? Two for one. Perfect. Perfect. Excellent. Any uh, number six? Who wants to do number six? Me, teacher. Hey, go ahead, Alvin. Today is not as windy as yesterday. Excellent. Very good. Perfect. Number seven. Yeah, me, teacher. Okay, go ahead. The tomato soup was as delicious as the mushroom soup. Okay, all right, just a little correction, Carlos. Soup, soup. Soup, uh, yeah, soup. Very good, soup. right? Remember that soap, existe la palabra soap, and I'm going to write it here, because it can be confusing, right? I know it can be confusing. Soap, soap, and soup, soup. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Soap es, es jabón, y soup yeah. es sopa. All right. Yes. All right. Very good. Thank, Thank you, you Carl. Yeah, no problem. Thank you for your for your participation. All right. Number eight. Who wants to do number eight? Me, teacher. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Grapefruit. Grape, grapefruit juice. It's is not. Sorry. Grapefruit juice is not as sweet as lemonade. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Excellent. What is grapefruit? ¿Qué significa grapefruit? It's juice of grapes. No. <laughs> no. Grapefruit juice. Grapefruit is toronja. Ah. Okay. All right, grapefruit. All right, it's toronja. All right, so remember that. All right, let me see. Eh, eh, you probably saying grape, but I use it como uva, right? Yeah, but grapefruit is really toronja. All right. Let me see. Number nine. Who wants to know number nine? I can do it, teacher. All right, go ahead. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Do me. Okay. Uh, number number eight. Number number nine, right? Mm -hmm. Is Nick is uh, as brave as Kevin. Very good, excellent. All right, very good. And the person that, that said it, me, me, ahorita, who was it? Quien era? I can do number me, Jackie. Okay, go ahead, Jackie. Number 10, silver is not as heavy as gold. Very good, excellent. Very good, perfect. All right, this was just a little activity to do um, using as and negative as and using in comparative with adjectives, with adjectives, right? Let me see. Okay, now. This activity. We probably won't. We'll do this one uh, another time. Okay, esta la vamos a hacer otro día. When we have free time. More free time. This one, you will do. Esto sería the final activity for this unit. All right. Now. I'm going to share it in the in the group so you can have it. All right. Now this is in writing. This is writing only. All right. The last ones that we did were speaking. This is a little bit of grammar and now is is your own your own words. Now um I'm going to call on let me see Iris. Yes, teacher. Okay, can you read number one please? Number one, explain in your own words, what is logistic? All right. So this is in your own words. You can see it in your own words, your own words. What, what does that mean? Tus propias palabras. Yes, very good. That way I don't get no confusion at the end where someone didn't understand something. Explique sus propias palabras que es logística. Explaining your own words. I don't want the definition from Google. All right. Voy a revisar todo eso. This is the last homework. Esta es la última actividad que vamos a hacer la, la unidad. For this unit. Explaining your own words. In your own words. Mm -hmm. En sus propias palabras. Breve. All right. Maybe one sentence. Si en una oración usted me puede dar algo específico de la logística. Lo acepto. All right. Si ve un gran paragraph así, significa que fue a Google y empezó a copiar todo. All right? And all I'm going to do is copiar el texto en Google y si me sale un match, lo voy a, I'm going to just, uh, not, I'm not even going to read it. All right? So I want it in your own words. I want to read you. Yo quiero leer a ustedes, no a Google. All right? You can use some words. Algunas palabras obvias tienen que ir ahí. But I want you to explain it in your own words. What is logistics? Ustedes pueden leer en Google. You can go look at different things and then come with a conclusion. Deme una conclusión, algo breve. Explaining your own words, what is logistics. Number two, Iris, continue. Explain in your own words, what is 3 p.m. All right, very good. In your own words, again, en sus propias palabras, what is 3 p.m. Lo hemos visto en toda eh, la unidad. Bueno. Well, Finales, la, la última semana de, de logística. 3PL, right? What is 3PL, class? ¿Qué significa 3PL? Party logistic. Very good. Third party logistics, right? Y eso lo hemos utilizado. You did it on your presentation. Hicimos la actividad el viernes, right? Pertaining to 3PLs. So I don't expect, no espero que alguien me diga, teacher, yo no sé qué es 3PL, no entiendo eso, right? We've been working on it for a whole week. For weeks, we've been working on it. And we did an activity on Friday, right? Now, and it's on unit two. So in your own words, right? So maybe unas dos oraciones, two sentences. If you can just give me something brief 
Or if you want to write a little bit more, you can. Okay, no, look, tampoco voy a limitarlos. If you want to give me three sentences or a little bit more, you can. What is 3PL? Lo que no quiero es una historia. All right. I don't want a whole story. No, I want you in your own words. Conclude. Give me a brief summary. Deme una pequeña conclusión de que en su propia palabra, que es 3PL, third party logistics. Now, no más son cuatro, it's only four questions. It is, continue, please. Number three. List, list some qualities you will want a 3PL to have. Very good, right? So if you, if you, we practice some of it on Friday, right? Remember, el viernes le dije que se seleccionara una eh, que ustedes consideran positiva para ustedes, right? Remember that? Ahora aquí viene el juego esto. Aquí van a elegir some qualities. ¿Cuántas? Eh, maybe two or three. Right? No quiero complicarles tampoco. Van a ganar diez. No. All right? Two or three could be fine. If you want to give me more, you can. This is based on you. Esto es relacionado a usted. If you hire a third-party logistic, any third-party logistics, ¿qué cualidades usted quisiera que tuviera? What qualities would you want? We saw it on Friday, right? On Friday, I gave you access to a lot of companies, third-party logistics, where you decided, ustedes decidieron elegir las positivas, right? Now, if I tell you right now, okay, it is, what qualities would you want a 3PL to have? ¿Qué cualidades de, de third party G le gustaría que tuviera si usted contrataría uno de estos? Right? And you decide. Usted me da sus propias opiniones. You, you can take it out of your mind or you can go back and look and get some ideas, right, eh, that we did on Friday. You can do that also. All right. Aquí una dos o tres con dos. Aquí es listar. No me van a explicar. Just list. Listar esa cualidad. One, two, three. Or two. All right. Mínimo dos, máximo tres. Number four. It is. Write a paragraph explaining what you have learned in Unit 2 Logistics. And 50 words. Very good, right? Here you're going to write a paragraph. What is paragraph? ¿Qué significa paragraph? What, what do I mean by paragraph? Paragraph. Very good. Paragraph. Excellent. Very good. Paragraph, right? How many words? 50. Right? Approximate. Okay? 45, 50, I will accept. Una oración, no. All right. This is explaining. Todo va a ser individual. So they can no puedo recibir la misma de, de dos personas, right? So this is individual. You're going to explain. You're going to write a paragraph explaining what you have learned. Explicando qué ha aprendido usted about unit two logistics. 50 words, right? No quiero 300. I don't want 200. No es un ensayo. Right, it's a paragraph, 50 words. Así, pequeñito, 50 words, right? That's it. Eso sería todo. All right, this you will send to me. Esto sí me lo mandarían, all right? And I will include it. Esto lo voy a incluir con todas las tareas que hemos hecho. And this is in-class activity. All right, so I'm going to give you the rest of the time. Le voy a dar el resto de la clase to do it. Y así no tienen tarea. All right, and then you can rest. When you finish, all you have to do is send it to me. Y aquí voy a estar para ayudarles. I'm going to be here if you have a question or a doubt or anything. All right, 
lo preferiría, I would prefer if you send it in writing. Eh, cosa que lo escriban en un cuadernito. Or a page or something. Right? Así lo prefiero. Why? ¿Por qué? Porque si se equivocan lo puede corregir. En cambio, si están en el teléfono, en el laptop, you're going to be probably making a lot of mistakes. Y Google, I mean, uh, the, some phones automatically correct some words y se las va a poner en español. Right? When you use the phone. Unless you feel confident to do it on your computer, then you can do it there and send me your screenshot. The screenshot. Me mandan la captura de la pantalla de la computadora. That would be also except. Okay, let me turn off a microphone right here. There's a dog barking. All right.
Teacher, I have a question. Yes, it is. How many qualities uh, uh, we need for activity activity number three? Okay. For you need two to three. Okay. Okay. Two or three. Okay, it is.
Okay, Carlos, I just finished reading yours. Yes, teacher. Right. And also ver verified on Google to see if everything was wasn't just copied, right? Let me see. I'm sorry. It's, let me see. Sorry, I didn't understand. Yeah. The no. Disregard. Disregard. Right. Please send your name with the activity. Okay. When you finish the activity, send your name with it. All right. Please. Okay, teacher. All right. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, I just sent my four answers. Hmm? I did it. I did it on my phone because I, I don't have my notebook here. Okay, no problem. Just shake and let me know, please. All Thank right. you. No problem. I send you my answer, teacher. Okay. Uh, very good, uh, Neftali. Neftali. <laughs> Was it Alvin? <laughs> yes, this is completely. <laughs> it, was a, it was a new topic for me. I, I didn't know a lot of things of this. Yeah, so it was a challenge, a really challenge for me. All right. Yes. Yeah, uh, but I, I, I'm, I'm very grateful for this. Well, I'm grateful for having you also, right? Let's see. But very well done, Alvin. And that's what I'm looking for, your own opinions. Perfect. Excellent. Okay, Glenda.
Very good. Very interesting what you wrote. All right. Okay, let me start writing. Empezar a hacer este listado. Teacher, I send my homework. Okay. Carlos Alvin Nestadi Glenda Juan Jose Carla Telma. Okay. All right, two, four, six, seven. All right, if you didn't finish, you can send it to me before 12, all right? Antes de la 12. After 12, uh, I will not accept it. Because I have to, lo tengo que poner incluido en las actividades de clase. All right, so I have to send everything today by 12. I think I gave you plenty of time. See someone just send it to me. Okay. Okay, Jennifer, let me add you to the list. Jennifer, thank you. Okay, teacher. Okay, Edwin, thank you for sending it. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Llevo nueve ahorita nomás. Only nine people have sent it. Nine participants. I I will check them also. All right, I checked some, but it's already time to do the uh, the final attendance. And remember that tomorrow we will begin unit three. Right, unit three. It's about um, warehousing, warehouse, right? warehouse. Yeah. Todo lo que tenga que ver con bodega, right? warehouse. And then unit four will be inventory, inventario. Let me. Okay, Abigail. Present. Thank you. Blanca? Present. Okay, thank you. Let me check something real quick. Okay, Brenda? Brenda? Okay, zero. Carlos? I'm here present, teacher. Thank you. Doris? Present. Thank you. Edwin? 
Present. Thank you. Francisco. <clears throat> Francisco. Okay, he was here earlier, disconnected. Okay, Freddy's. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Glenda. Present, teacher. Thank you. Iris. Present, teacher. All right. Jackie. I'm here. All right, thank you. Jarvin. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jennifer. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Juan Jose. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Carla? Present. All right, thank you. Miguel? Miguel? Okay, he didn't connect. Zero. Yeah, this works. All right, Neftali? Present teacher, sorry. No problem, thank you. Okay, Rolando, Rolando, okay, didn't connect, zero. Thelma? Present teacher. Thank you, Janari? Janari? Okay, she was here, she disconnected. <clears throat> All right, let me put that there. All right, Alvin? Present teacher. Thank you. Okay, class. We will, uh, if you if you can finish it whenever you can, you can send it to me, right, this activity, or send me what you have, right? I mean, you can send me what you have if you don't finish also, right? Tan siquiera que, que me sean que, que trató de terminarlo. That would be awesome too, okay? I will accept it like that if you can complete it. Okay, let me see. It is. All right, let me add you to it. It is. All right. And that is. All right. Thank you for sending it. I will verify and I will respond back. And the person that stays today is Carla. Okay, you stay for the extra 10 minutes. Everyone else, try to scan the your book for tomorrow. It's going to be a new topic. It's about warehouse, okay? Warehouse. So I'll see you tomorrow, class. Take care. Good night. And be ready for tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good Thank best teacher. teacher. All right. Bye-bye. Good night, everyone. All right. Sure. Good evening.